Hi everybody, Paul back again from Ballistic Blood Blitz with an update video and uh, today seemed appropriate to do a new video as two packages arrived, one from Amazon France and the other from an order placed through eBay. <coughs> And uh, what we have got is two steelbooks and a Blu-ray of a film that I've been after for quite a long time, which I've been waiting for to come out in uh, the UK, but uh, that release doesn't seem to be forthcoming, so I've sourced it from elsewhere. But uh, on to the goodness. And the first movie that uh, arrived in one of the two packages is the steelbook edition of Lawless. Now this, as you will all doubtlessly know, was originally an, a Play.com exclusive <coughs> and the steelbook sold out at pre-order because it was, I believe, the last steelbook limited edition that Play.com uh, are to sell or have thus far announced, subject to what their future holds. And of course this then hit eBay and was selling for silly prices, £25, £30, £35. But um, what happened is with the news of Play.com and their closure, main closure, is that uh, Zavi, uh, and also uh, a UK online store, have picked up their still books and uh, they had this one, and they reissued it again. And uh, I'm very fortunate to have this one because once again I can report that Zavi's steelbook has also sold out and gone out of print. But very pleased to have this one. I really, really wanted a very nice matte finish and uh, debossed uh, bullet holes. These bullet holes here are actually very, very cool. Indented into the steelbook itself. <coughs> I have a very clean, crisp spine with the name of the film. And again, we have a very smooth, clean, crisp reverse art to the movie. Still book. And again, those bullets, bullet holes, are all indented, debossed. Gives a very, very cool effect to it. And, uh, very pleased I was able to pick up this edition of the film and by all intents and purposes reviews of the film are very good as well so very much looking forward to looking and watching the film as well <coughs> excuse me here we have the blu-ray disc itself and again some nice artwork with some of the main stars of the film and this one is a Region B locked disc, unfortunately. But uh, what we also get, hurrah, is some nice interior reverse artwork for the film as well. Sets the movie off very, very nicely. There's been a few Blu-ray releases recently which don't have the interior artwork. And it is just so much of a letdown, but this very pleased to say, isn't the case. And uh, we have a cracking interior artwork. Very, very nice indeed. And just to give a global look of the landscaped version of the still book. <coughs> and it does come with the very cool slip-on card index the exterior of the film as well gives us the information pertaining to the movie all the goodness and goodies that go with it 1080p blu-ray hd transfer of course 5.1 dts hd master audio and uh, we do have bonus material and uh, some goodies for the movie so very very cool very very nice that is the zavi.com Blu-ray steelbook edition of Lawless. Looking very much forward to watching that. Anybody who's seen the film, please do let me know your thoughts about the film. 
and uh, anybody who has the film, which Steelbook exclusive do you actually have? Be it the Play.com one or the same identical one, but now from Zavi. Right, the next film that uh, came in the post today is an exclusive Steelbook edition from Amazon France. And that is Resident Evil Retribution. And this is not only the Blu-ray edition, but it's the 3D Blu-ray HD version of the film as well. And this is a very nice looking steelbook. Very pleased that I uh, went for this one. Again, this is one that was an HMV steelbook exclusive, but of course HMV, I have now learnt and received an email in fact confirming that pre-orders with them have all been cancelled. All of the exclusive steelbook editions, including Resident Evil Retribution, orders have been cancelled and they won't be forthcoming. And of course other companies such as Amazon.com and Zavi have picked up those steelbook order editions. And of course Zavi and Amazon, I hope in the future, will provide their own exclusive steelbook editions and uh, produce what HMV and Play.com may have done. But I'm very, very pleased with this because this for me, of all the steelbook editions of Resident Evil Retribution, does represent the best looking cover art both externally and internally, as we'll look at in a moment. But again, very, very nicely done. Very clean, very precise, nicely done spine. Looking at the <coughs> reverse. Again, very, very nice. That's Mila, and uh, that is a particularly exquisite looking rear, if I may say so. Or as the French themselves may well say, a derrière exquisite. <laughs> but that is a fine rear of a steelbook. Very, very nice indeed. Delighted with this one. Very, very, very pleased. And pleased that I did decide actually once discovering that uh, the steelbook limited edition from HMV was no longer going to be forthcoming. This was the one to go for. There is a very nice one also from Canada and I believe also America, but this one I think is the nicest of all. And just to look in the interior, even the Blu-ray discs themselves, they are very, very nice. And they have the Umbrella Corporation. That's the 3D disc. And there we also have the DVD disc. I guess some extras on there as well. This one again, being from Europe, is also <coughs> Region B locked. As we can see there, it is a Region B locked DVD and also Blu-ray disc, unfortunately. But very nicely done artwork on the discs. And again, we do have some nice interior reverse backing artwork as well with Mila and uh, again representative of the film itself but very very nice to see and uh, of what is indeed a very very cool steelbook blu-ray 3d edition from Amazon France and again just to look at the card, backing card, that comes stuck to the back of the Blu-ray steelbook. Again, telling you some goodness. It's all in French, of course, being a French release, so I can't tell you too much about it, unfortunately. But it is uh, in 2.40 widescreen format, HD 1080p, and it is 16.9 friendly television. <coughs> And it's master DTS HD 5.1 sound, so all the goodness that you could hope for. So no complaints there whatsoever. And again, a very, very nice edition from Amazon France. Very, very pleased with that. Very nice indeed. And to my final pickup. Again, 
very nice addition. And this is one that I've been after for a long, long time. And it is the big, fun animation, Ronald the Barbarian. And this again is also a 3D version that also does come with a DVD. Now, Ronald the Barbarian, title probably gives it away for those of you who are not familiar with this, is a bit of a play on, of course, Conan the Barbarian. But uh, this is a young fella uh, that, um, as you can tell by his skinny look, doesn't really hold up to being a barbarian. But his day comes, of course, and he has to prove himself, and he stands up to the task and put Conan the Barbarian to one side because you can rely on Ronald the Barbarian. Balls as big as brass and feet big enough to fill the shoes of Conan in all its animated glory. Delighted to receive this one because this release from France does come with an English dubbed version of the film. Now the film is also available on Blu-ray in I believe Holland and Germany but I think that uh, at least one of them comes with subtitles but I don't think either of them do come with an English dub. And as I say, I have been anticipating this one being released in the UK and or America with a, an English translation, English dialogue, but it hasn't been forthcoming. So really wanted to see this one. Looks a lot of fun. And uh, having seen that uh, the French version comes with an English dialogue dub, had to get in there, had to pick it up. Really, really looking forward to seeing this one. It does come with a very cool slip cover for the film release as well, which is pretty much the same front and rear artwork as the Blu-ray disc itself. But it's always nice to have those protective covers and the extra artwork that uh, comes with it as well. This is the interior of the Blu-ray release and as you can see there are two discs. We do have a DVD version of the film and also the Blu-ray version of the movie as well and in 3D. Good artwork there, very nice to see, always nice. Uh, there's no exterior, sorry, exterior, there's no interior behind artwork but this is a standard Blu-ray. I do really like it with the steelbooks, not so worried about it in the, the Blu-ray DVD releases, particularly with the Blu-rays here because with the translucent DVD casings the blue does come through so it effectively shows us that it's a Blu-ray which is very nice. But uh, very very nice indeed. And uh, this is a film reading about it and looking at the trailer for it. I can highly recommend. Having not, I've not seen the film yet, looking forward to it. But everything about it says fun. Lots of big, bawdy, barbarian, sword and sorcery, hammer and tongs, fun. A bit like a carry-on film with a 15 rating. And as I say, lots of bawdy action. Good, good fun. That is Ronald the Barbarian. So there we are. We have three very much welcome editions arrived in the post today. And just to summarize for you, we have Mila Jovovich in Resident Evil Retribution 3D, number five in the series. We have the very nicely debossed with the bullets indentations of Lawless. And the big, bawdy, fun animation come to life farce that is Ronald the Barbarian. Excellent stuff. Thank you all so very much for watching. Hope that uh, you enjoyed this one. Looking forward to watching all of the movies. And uh, do let me know your thoughts on any of the films that we've touched on today. But uh, thanks for watching. Take care, everybody. See you all soon. Bye for now.